Wednesday you have gardening, Michelle. We're not feeding the squirrels this year. I wing things a lot. We're just winging this. Hi everybody, welcome back. Today I'm in front of my greenhouse, my greenhouse, and I thought, let's replant some plants. I have these tomato plants. Today you have gardening, Michelle. I have these plants. Okay, let's start by saying I've never done this before. We'll start there, but I'm enjoying this. And I made the greenhouse. I got a heater in there. I have a video on that. These plants are getting tall. So, I thought, let's replant them. And I'm going to put them in red solo cups because that's what you do. You plant them in red solo cups. It's got to work, right? Use what you have. Okay, I have a bucket of dirt, bucket of dirt, bucket of dirt, and a spoon. We're gonna do that with this. Hold on a minute, I got something else. For my birthday this year, my mom and dad bought me this with all these gardening tools in there. And I'm sure there's something in here that I can use for this. Let me look, I'll be right back. I found a shovel, I found this. It's got like, it's got like inches on it. Look at that. I'm assuming this is a bulb planter or something that you need to go deep with. But this is narrow, so we're using this. I'm not going to need my spoon. Thank you, parents. Now, if you notice, when I planted these, I wasn't sure how many seeds to put in there. So I dumped a couple. I'll show you when we pull one out. But there's a lot of them in there. And I think there's probably too many. I don't know. Let's replant some tomatoes. So I got my bucket of dirt, bucket of dirt, bucket of dirt. We're gonna fill up, fill up the cup. Probably, yeah. We'll just fill it up that full. It's up, it's about to there. I hope I don't break these plants when I get them out of here. I don't know. We'll have to see. Oh, hold on a minute. There's a tray on the bottom. It might be easier if I take it out of this and then I could push it out. Oh, yep, see, look at that. And I'm thinking, oh, yep, see, this is why I wanted to do that. See the roots? They don't have anywhere to go. So if I put them in this red Solo cup, they'll have somewhere to go. And I might plant it a little deeper, like that deep. I mean, I dropped it in there like probably an inch. I don't know. We're going to loosely cover this with soil now. Loosely covering it. This is a nice little shovel. Nice little shovel here. We've had a little bit of a mix up with our plants because I didn't label them good enough. Next year I'll do better there. Now there's two tomatoes in there. One of them's a little one and I probably could pick these bottom things off. I think the bottom leaves come off. They're coming off. Let's hope I don't kill them. I don't want to murder my tomato plants. That looks good. All right. It's kind of wobbly. Maybe the next one I'll plant a little deeper. Maybe we'll do that. If I run out of soil in my bucket, we had a bunch of topsoil delivered. I'll just use that. Let me fill this up. Let's see. That's a clump. Yeah, I'm going to go deeper with the next one, I think. So I probably don't need that much dirt. Now this in no way is a tutorial on how to plant. This is just watch Michelle plant and watch Michelle get dirt all over her kitchen. All right, we'll go for this one. We'll just squeeze that little bugger out of there. And I'm gonna try, I think I'm gonna be careful with these cause well, I have a whole nother tray I could plant. I'm gonna plant sunflowers. No, see, I want that deeper. I'm gonna plant sunflowers inside the house this year because Last year I planted them outside and the squirrels ate all the seeds, so we had no sunflowers. So this year I thought I would, oh there's a stick, I'll plant them inside the house and get the plant growing, then we'll 
have flowers. That's a brilliant idea. We're not feeding the squirrels this year. Oh crap, I just got dirt everywhere. That's probably good. We'll just give them a little another dose. Bottom leaves are coming off. See, I'm picking the bottom leaves off. There. I wonder if I should be planting them deeper. I bet I could. I have no idea. All you fancy gardeners are probably watching me right now and gagging. What is she doing? She doesn't know what she's doing. She's filling up a cup with dirt and putting her plant in there. Let's just go with one scoop and see what happens. Oh, see this one? There's three. I have three. I'll show you if I can break one. There's three in there. Do I leave all three or do I take one out? I don't know. But in the red solo cup it goes. I don't know. Am I supposed to? I don't know. I don't know. Listen, I wing things a lot. We're just winging this. Have you watched my cooking videos? My dehydrating videos? I just wing. Let's try. Ah, now it fell over. I just wing it. Because I didn't. Did I watch a tutorial on how to plant a tomato? No, I, I didn't. <sighs> this hurts my back. I'm leaning over. I need a taller workspace. Oh, oh, I have dirt everywhere. I do. There. Now that looks a little better. The root is deeper, and I'm thinking it might do better in the garden if it has more base. See the difference? This one is kind of fault. Maybe I'll fill him up more. lot of tomato plants oh I was saying I had a little mix-up so I think that these are like beefsteak tomatoes I didn't label very good so they might be like Amish paste tomatoes I'm gonna try to clean my mess up I got a mess or um, Amish paste tomatoes that I got from somewhere I don't know I wish I remembered that some of them are just plain romas and I don't remember I, I don't remember I really messed the peppers up I really messed the peppers up because I have green peppers planted and I have Hungarian hot wax planted and in my brain it was working at the time in my brain I said okay I know that these are green and these are hot I, I know that so but then I started switching them around in the little greenhouse that I made and it, it just went to pot from there I had to replant something which I think I had to replant the green peppers so I put toothpicks in the green peppers that I think that I needed to replant so we're either going to have a lot of green peppers or a lot of hot peppers pepper surprise at my house watch for that oh and I, I really did a bad job at labeling let me tell you well, that one's kind of deep. There. That's deep. Alright, well, let me show you over here. I'm not real sure what is what. Now, I had all this lined up. And I had written on these what these were in here. And these are either squash. Maybe somebody could tell me that's either a squash or a cucumber. I'm not real sure. Because they're over here, too. Oh, this is a squash because it has squash in there. Maybe I'll try to match the leaves, leaves up and figure that out. I, I, I don't know. I have a lot of things going on in my life right now. This pandemic has given not me a break, but that's okay. I'm helping out. I'm schooling my brothers, my sister-in-law, their children. So I've got, see that one has four. Well, five, six, if you count the little one. We should take the little ones out. I know that's too many. I'm going to have too many here. Well, you know, I hate to kill it. I hate to pull that out of there. I just, that breaks my heart to pull that out of there. I can't do that. So he's in there. Add some more dirt. My husband just said, hey, do you want to go fishing this weekend? Oh, yeah, sure I do. Oh, wow, Michelle, you really made a mess. 
that's sad. I'm gonna have to fix that. So I guess I guess we're going fishing this weekend. I don't know what we're gonna fish for. I don't really like fish. I'm not a fish eater. I like like shrimp and stuff like that, but straight fish, I'm, I don't like straight fish. There. I'm, I hope that these aren't going to be. Maybe I only should do half the tray right now to make sure these don't die. Maybe I'll do that. And give it like two days and see what happens. And then go from there. All right. That's a big stick. All right, let me get this one out of here. This is going to be half the trip. Oh, come on. There. He only has two. All right. All right, we'll fill this one up with dirt. I really do have dirt everywhere. I'm really glad I have this shovel. This is, it would have been harder to do with a spoon. Because I can kind of get right down in there where it needs to be. There's the big stick back. Maybe I'll, I'm only, yeah, probably a good decision. Because I am planting these kind of deep. I don't know if that matters or not. All right, I'm gonna only do half, I'm only gonna do half of these and see how these do. So I'll put these back like this in my, in my greenhouse over here. And then I've got these planted now in my red solo cups. Red solo cups can be very useful. I have a lot of them. I don't know why. I just do. And I better clean my dirt mess up. But we'll check back in on these in a, a couple days. And I'll let you know how they're doing. And if they're doing okay, I'm going to plant the rest of them like this. Even the peppers. Because these are my peppers here and here. And I had to replant these. And I know these have stakes in them. So I know that those are green pepper plants. And I... And I don't know why I have yellow leaves either. I guess I'll have to figure that out. Maybe I'm watering them too much. I, I don't know. I'm trying. We'll come back in a couple days and see how this is doing. Alright, well. I will see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe because you don't want to miss my tomatoes. Let's see if Michelle's tomatoes make it. And uh, I'll see you later. Bye.